Hey, you. How are you doing today? Are you going to re-offer? Yeah. I've already had my nomination. Oh, really? Yeah, you Not, know. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, no. You, do you follow me on Facebook? Uh, do I follow anyone on Facebook? I don't know. I asked you the question first. Though. Yeah, but I mean, I'm too busy talking about me, 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 me. <laughs> Listen, uh, the conservative is cut, cut, cut. Yeah, I got this on. The sun. Uh, liberals. Uh, what's, the, what's the difference between a liberal and a conservative? Well, you know, I mean, you've made a judgment there already in the, your first preamble that uh, cuts, cuts, cuts. I, I don't agree with. But the thing is, is that we've seen a significant amount of uh, expenditures that uh, haven't had the results that are, uh, you know, we hope for. You know, in the last four years, the Liberals have taken more than a billion dollars out of the uh, taxpayers' pockets, and we've still got long wait lines at the hospital. We've still got low scores of education. We've got, uh, you know, people. That's the main issue, doctors. people so, looking into. What I want to talk yeah. about is like the justice system. Oh, the justice system. Well, I'm not as familiar with the justice system as you probably are. You only get involved in issues when it affects you, huh? No, no. no? Uh, you know, and I, I can see you're in an argument of uh, mood? mood there this morning. Uh, well, uh, full, so. moon, full moon tonight. Oh, that's what it is. Uh, effects, effects my... Yeah, uh, see, yeah. You can see, I can see me through, the, <laughs> through those sunglasses. Excellent. No, prisoners, so, well, prisoners forcing to walk home from Miramichi, from St. John. Once their sentence is done, uh, they give them a Google map and say... Uh, bunch of us. Oh, yeah. and then they walk in the snow or in the, if they're lucky they walk in the summer with the mosquitoes they hate right yeah. would the conservative look at that policy well uh, that's a good question and uh, again I don't have all the details on, on what that policy you're referring to isn't that to a political is. answer no but I'm just saying I, I really don't and need to do more research but, you know it's unfortunate that people don't have the support network uh, in place. That's right. That when they do get out, somebody can, you know, uh, uh, address those needs of transportation. So, um, you know, but, it, but it's unfortunate that people are just left in the lurch. I mean, if, if my memory serves me right, and I'm going from memory here because you've caught me off guard. That Always. I mean, it wouldn't be. Uh, you yeah. don't expect me to send you oh, an, yeah, email, sure. an email and arrange a little interview, right? Well, sometimes you might get a, a better reception. No, no, no. But you no. always get a good reception. Oh, yes. Me. Always, always. Um, There's yeah. no editing here. That's why. No, I know. It's, yeah. yeah free, Go ahead. Free, uh, free space. Oh, yeah. Um, you know, so... No editing to make you look bad. No, but, but that goes back to a system, again, where... The, uh, the liberals are continuing to throw money at, at issues that they think, mm -hmm. uh, but but yet there's no um, outcome, there's no uh, measurement of the management, and are we doing better than we've done before? One more thing, one more thing. Okay, okay, I know, I, I know. Yep. But uh, one more thing. Okay, now, do you know? Are you familiar with a uh, Caroline Warnock? No, I'm not familiar with that. No. Are you familiar with uh, Tyler uh, Tyler Richard Sweeney? No. No. That guy died a few months ago in the Shidiat jail. They found him dead. And Caroline Warnot was found dead in a Miramichi woman, a, shot, a woman prison, provincial jail. Mm. And there's no coroner inquest. There's nothing. Why are we doing that? Look, that's a good question, Charles. And I don't have the details of the cases, so... Again? I, no, I really can't. I'm telling you the details. Well, you're telling me the, the I'm trying details. To and it's always tragic. Or, or something like that. Yeah. You know, I think back to the Ashley Smith. Crisis, Ashley Smith. Yeah. Which was a, a, you know, a widely publicized and yeah. discussed issue. And, you know, it uh, it is tragic that at this day and age, we're still having those issues occur uh, in, in our system. So. When somebody dies in the responsibility of the government, shouldn't there be an inquest to find out how that person died? Yeah. Now, my understanding, there's always a... A review or some kind of inquest. Internal. And again, Internal. Yeah, and I don't have the details uh, of those cases and you know to comment on them. So, so what what brings you here anyway? Pardon? What brings you here? Oh, I've got some. I know you work here. You're yeah. an MLA. You're yeah, not like me. Exactly. So. You know, as an MLA, you've still got responsibilities here in in uh, Fredericton with staff that you have to uh, uh, discuss and and uh, talk about. This. So it's it's a busy day with elections. I'll end up in Rosse later tonight and. Uh, all the MLAs are all uh, nomination all over? Um, we're pretty close. I know we've got people in every riding, and uh, I, last night I went to a memorable 
Andrew Meyer. And who's the, who's the deputy? Gannett is down there and he's a veteran. He's a solid candidate, a really good candidate. He speaks with passion and conviction and uh, he's running for our party because he wants to make a difference in New Brunswick. One more question. He's a 21 year veteran and four tours of duty. So, uh, wow, if very I, impressive. If I put you on totally the spot, if I, put, if I put you on the spot, I'll let you promote uh, a candidate. That's okay. Who's the MLA PC that lost his nomination? Oh, Brian Kirsten? Yeah, what, uh, what's, what's all that about? Democracy. You yeah. know, the... the uh, I never hear much from him. I never hear much from him when he was... Well, I, maybe that was part of the issue. But, uh, you know, Mike Holland was a gentleman from uh, Albert County, uh, originally from the Miramichi. And uh, anyways, he decided to put his hand up and say, I want to do that job. And with the nomination... He got more what was the vote? Than the, I don't know. Uh, they didn't reveal the, the vote at the meeting, and I, I was away, so I wasn't at that particular nomination. But um, anyways, Mike got the nod. Now he's out uh, campaigning for uh, PCs. And How's Brian taking all this? Oh, it's uh, look. I've I've lost elections in my life, and it's always dead. Yeah, but the nomination. It's always the nomination. Uh, well, we're not like Gallant, well, where he appoints people, and you know. We're going back to, to Gallant again. Uh, well, it's all about Gallant right now because he's the chief executive officer of the. You know, he's the, the 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 premier, and he makes a lot of decisions that, in my opinion, haven't been good for the province of New Brunswick.